Our top story tonight, Singapore may have environmentally friendly outdoor Wi-Fi nationwide in the not too distant future. The government has launched solar powered Wi-Fi hotspots on Sentosa. And if this pilot trial is successful, it will be expanded. Patrick John Lim with more. The green Wi-Fi initiative is being piloted in Sentosa along Malayan Walk until September next year. While there are already more than 200 hotspots outdoors in Sentosa, IDA has decided to explore solar energy to deliver outdoor Wi-Fi in a cost-effective and environmentally sustainable manner. The regulator has partnered several industry players, including local tech firm Skylab, to introduce the solar-powered hotspot. Traditionally, installing outdoor hotspots require extensive digging and laying of cables. In switching to solar power, ID believes it will cut construction costs as well as speed up implementation. We see that the deployment has been significantly faster, so we are quite pleased with the speed of deployment. And in terms of cost, we are beginning to see that um, the savings can be as, uh, as little as 50% of what it would take to deploy uh, using the traditional methods. If this pilot is successful, and I believe it will, we could potentially expand wireless at SG to reach more outdoor areas in a sustainable manner and bring the public Wi-Fi coverage in Singapore to the next level. Consumers were open to the idea of outdoor wireless as network connectivity and speed remained important considerations. I find it more convenient and it saves my data plan. I guess it's more convenient, like you can update uh, the people at social media, like at where you are. Like this is much more better, because like we can enjoy like the nature, uh, other than like aircon places. I think it's uh, useful because the connection is quite fast, uh, and uh, I can uh, connect uh, rapidly and easily. One analyst said it's with technological advancement that such ideas are now feasible. But he added the bigger challenge is in maintaining the infrastructure and ensuring a consistent network experience. The technology is getting better, the spectrum use is becoming more efficient and so on. So I think that technical issue will be ironed out over time. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, I think the bigger challenge that we'll face moving forward will be managing and maintaining this infrastructure because it'll be obviously, especially if it's outdoors, it will be susceptible to physical conditions, to weather conditions and so on. Uh, so the, those will be the, the bigger challenges I think we'll start to face. Skylab says it has a maintenance schedule in place for its green Wi-Fi, which is equipped with an intelligent monitoring system. This allows users to check on the performance and the power levels of the system remotely.